Now that is what I'm talking about. All right, this is my Yamaha Kodiak 400. It's a 2000. I was just working on restoring these plastics, so this is kind of what we're looking at. It's really old and oxidized and whatever, but so it's been working for me. I take this razor blade. I work work on scraping off all that white stuff right there. So then when I get, get it close, so looking like that, then I use some sandpaper or I've been using steel wool to just basically get the rest of that white stuff off so it's looking looking good kind of like that and then you know I'm gonna finish this section right here and then I'm gonna work or go on to using this heat gun next so then I'll just heat up the plastic from there and we can take a look see how the well that works all right, so this is kind of what it looks like after I got done scraping and using the steel wool. I use some alcohol to just clean the surface. So now I just got a heat gun. I'm just gonna heat it up just to get that shine back. So heat up the areas and then when I'm kind of done, I like to wipe it down with some sort of shiner. This is some plastic renew, but you can use any sort of automotive shine so I'm gonna work on heating up this plastic make it look good so yeah, I'm just going on the lowest setting and just heating up the plastic so the top layer kind of just melts just going around just getting that sh trying to get that shine back so it's working kind of a section at a time um, just be careful don't overheat it so it gets all droopy but you just want to melt it enough to get that factory shine back so it's gonna continue to do this to this whole section here and then just gonna wipe it down with that ATV shine and then uh, we'll see how she looks so I just finished melting this area it's still warm so I'm just wiping her down I don't know it seems like it works better when you you know wipe it down after you get done doing it so, you know, let this dry and then we'll see how it looks. You know, actually, I think I'll probably just do this whole machine and then we'll see how uh, she turns out. All right, I got all the plastics done. I think it turned out pretty good. I even got that black part right there. So what worked best for me was just using the heat gun in high after I got all that white stuff off, so. You know, all plastics are different, so if you're thinking about doing this on yours, you know, Honda, Kawasaki, Suzuki, I just do a test spot on your plastic to see which method works the best for you because they all can be different. So, you know, I'm going to finish restoring this, you know, do the racks and this black metal, paint it up, and just get this thing looking real nice. So, thanks for watching, and uh, hopefully it works for you.